All right, everyone, I want to welcome you back to your next training video because I want to show you how to build any online business and how simple it is. Um, I know some of you guys may be afraid of like online stuff. Oh, I, I don't want to deal with that. But I'm telling you, if you create your own online business, you have the opportunity to create your own economy. Um, earn additional income because it's yours. And then you can focus on and work on leaving your nine to five if that's what you choose to do. For me, my goal is to never go back to a nine to five. So I want to show you, I want to share with you the things that I learned and I want to share with you so that you can build a business online by yourself. Now I'm here if you need me, if you want my help, I'm here for you. So we're going to go ahead and jump into this real quick. Um, and so we're going to be breaking this down into sections so that you won't be overwhelmed with the information that I provide. So in this video, we're going to talk about the tools that you need to build your business based on what I spoke about in my last video, the three steps to building any online business. All right. So I talked about that in my last video. If you haven't seen that video yet, I'm going to put a link um, in the description so that you can go ahead and view it. it you know, or it might be up top, you know, wherever you're watching this video, it'd be a link down below or up top if you're on YouTube watching this. And it should pop up right about now. Who knows? But I want to show you how you can start, how you can easily create and start your own online business from scratch. And that's what this training is all about. So without further ado, let's get into it. All right. So the first thing, there's three things that you're going to, there's three tools that you're going to need. All right. Um, in order to look professional. Okay. Because we want, we want to present ourselves in the most professional manner. Now I know that, you know, sometimes, you know, expenses, are a big deal for people. So I'm going to be including, you know, ways of you, how you can get things done for free. And however, you know, there are some downfalls to doing it, to, to using free tools. However, it's a great way to start if you don't have the money to invest in the tools that you need for your business. So the first thing that you're going to need is a domain name, all right? So I'm gonna be sharing my screen and, and showing you the best way to get a domain name, okay? And if you don't know what a domain name is, basically a domain name is a website address. So for instance, I have a blog, a website, and it's www.jay-henson.com. Uh, also have another domain name website, which is jcreatingwealth.com. So you can use a .com, .net, whatever you want to use. Um, I particularly like staying with .coms or .info. So I'm going to show you uh, a few places, a couple of places where you can get a really cheap domain name. All right. So let me share my screen and let me show you where you can get some of these domains at, all right? All right, let's go. All right, now, if you're looking for a domain name, if you don't have one, you can get one very, very cheap if you just Google 99 cent domains, okay? Because I believe that's probably about the cheapest. You may be able to find some cheaper. I don't know. Um, however, I usually go with uh, GoDaddy or Namecheap. Okay, so we're going to go over that. Um, this is GoDaddy, what you see right here. And what I did was I just Googled 99 cent domains. Okay, so you can get a domain name for 99 cent for an entire year. So what you want to do, uh, let's see. And you see here, you can have XYZ, website, club, online, dot site, dot fun, dot monster. I don't particularly like any of these, but you're more than welcome. If, 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 if money is an issue, you're more than welcome to choose either one of these uh, dot domains. Um, however, I don't particularly recommend it, but it's totally up to you. So um, where is 
it. Let me see here. Do that. Where is it? 99 cent domain. Let me go in here and and add another tab. Let's see, 99 cent. Go daddy. All right, so and with GoDaddy, you can create a website and stuff like that, but don't do it yet. All right. Don't do any of that stuff. All you need is a domain. That's it. You don't need all the other extras. Um, I also I have a video um, training on choosing your domain. Um, let me see. Um, okay. So you can find them by your 99 cent domain. So let's just say you want your domain, you want to put your domain, a potential domain name. So brainstorm a little bit because when you choose your domain name, if you're using it for business, um, you want to make sure that it is relevant. Um, now you can make it specific towards a particular product or you can make it specific to encompass all of you, like my jhenson.com, that I can put anything up under that domain. It doesn't matter what it is. I can carry that domain name with me to any business, any company um, that I choose to, all right? So and I can put anything on that website that I want to. Now, if you get specific, like, um, let's just say if I created, if I had a, a, a product, um, let's say weight loss product. So let's just say my, the name of my product is weight loss. Okay. So if I just put weight loss, now I am specifying as a good, as a pro and a con to that, because now I'm specifying, this is what my website is all about weight loss. However, you're restricting yourself because now the only thing that you can do on that website or with that domain is uh, weight loss stuff. And that's okay. So you have to choose what's best for you. So what you want to do, let's just say I'm looking for uh, zero, zero, um, let's just say my name of my company is zero marketing. That, that zero marketing.com. You want to put the dot com. If you really want a dot com, I suggest you put a dot com there. However, it will show you the different suggestions. So we want to do that. Whoa. Okay. We don't want that one. Hold on. <laughs> let's see. What, <laughs> let's see. Um, let's see what else we, we got here. <laughs> 1995. Are you crazy? Uh, we're looking for 99 cent. It looks like the only 99 cent domain they have here is XYZ. Um, GoDaddy used to have a special for 99 cent domains. However, it looks like their special is no longer there, but still search it out for them. Um, let's just say it's, I'm going to just put my, it's our time to be free.com. All right, so here, this is uh, the domain name I put. It's our time to be free, which is my tagline, which is, you know, um, what I use. Uh, it's twelve ninety nine a year. Now, another place that you can go to is Namecheap. I've used Namecheap before, and you can find ninety nine cent domains here, and they actually right now they have a promo code for ninety nine special. Um, you put that promo code in at the checkout for the ninety nine cent domain. Let's see, I'm gonna put the same thing. It's our time to be free. I'm gonna search it. Do Come on. Okay. 
So this is what I'm talking about. Um, see, they say 99 cent domains. I'm sure they probably have some, but depending on the name that you choose, um, some of them are not 99 cent, but this is the cheapest route uh, available. Like the dot com is 888 a, 888 a year. All right, versus GoDaddy. Uh, where'd it go? Uh, GoDaddy was $12.99 for the first year. All right. So for me, I, you know, I would probably go with Namecheap. It's for a year. But there are some names that you can see just like this one here. Um, for XYZ, it's a dollar, a dollar a year. Okay. Now it's $7.99 for two years but it breaks down once you put it in. But we're going to try this real quick. We're going to add to this to cart and try that don't and try that uh, the coupon code and see if it works. Now you can do more than one year, but if you're new to this, I suggest you just go with one year. What is a, um, what was that? Oh, I forgot the, the coupon code. Uh, let me see. Forgot the coupon code. 99 special, okay. Let's go back over here and go 99 special and see if it applies. All right, so I want you to log in or create a free account. Okay. I don't have my account info saved on here, but you can just go in to uh, and just put that coupon code in and see if it works for you. All right. So the first thing that you're going to need is a domain name. All right. So I've gone over two uh, different sites that you can go to and you're more than welcome to search 99 cent domain and find some other companies. I particularly go with uh, usually Namecheap or GoDaddy. Those are the two that I recommend. Those are the two that's, that I know that is pretty reputable, okay? So we've done that. So let me stop my screen share for a minute. All right, so now you understand about domain names. And like I said, I will link another video about uh, choosing your domain name. But um, so you need that domain name. The number two tool, the second tool that you're going to need is a page builder and basically a page builder basically it's like a landing page opt-in page people call it different different terms okay basically you're going to need a page for potential customers to leave their email address all right so which we call a landing page where you enter information where you enter your name and email and, and in return, you get something that you want. Now you see this all over the place. Let's just say you're visiting a website, you know, and you get a pop-up, subscribe for update, subscribe for updates, and you enter your email and 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 everything because you want to be updated about that website. Or you might be on a website and it say, um, subscribe, and you'll um, receive this free download. Okay because people were looking for that product or service. So they will input their information in and in exchange, you will send them that information that they wanted. So basically you're going to need a page builder to build out pages just like that. Now I'm going to go over a few, few places that you can get this done at, all right? All right, so I'm gonna share my screen again and let's jump into this one.
All right. Now, there are several different page builders that you can go with. So I'm going to give you um, several that you can go with. I'll give you the one that I recommend. And I'll also show you um, uh, the most common ones and the ones that you can use, all right? So let's get into it. The first one here is called ClickFunnels. This is a big, 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 big company, all right? They are really, really good at what they do. I love their funnel systems. I love their pages. However, what I don't like is the price point, all right? Because it's $97 a month. But you can do, you can do all of these things on here, all right? The next one, this is Builderall. This is another funnel uh, builder that a lot of marketers use. Now this plan, the cheapest one is like $29.90 a month. It's up to you. Um, now these do have, some of these do have restrictions and things like that. So you have to go in here and search these out and check to see if it's right for you. All right. Um, so we have ClickFunnels, Builderall. Uh, we have lead pages. Okay, all of these things do the same thing. There may be a little difference between them. Um, so you have to go in and see and select which one is right for you. And most of them do come with a free trial. So you can check them out and see if it's something that you like or not. Now, Lead Pages does the same thing and it's $27 a month, all right? Now, Here's a free option for you because I always want to make sure that you know you have the opportunity to get what you need, even starting out if you don't have the funds to invest in your business right away. Uh, and then eventually you can scale up and move to a different platform if you choose to. Now, this is your free option, um, which is called Groove Funnels, it does the same thing as Click Funnels, uh, Lead Pages, and uh, what was the other one? And Builderall, okay? Pretty much does the same thing. Now, right now, it is free for a limited time. But when they um, when they remove the free option, it's going to cost you $99 a month. So you may want to check to see if you come in on the free option, will it always be free? Or is the price going to change to $99 a month? All right. Now, me in particular, I use a different funnel builder because, and I'm going to show you why. And it is called the HBA funnel builder. Okay. Um, and this funnel builder does is four times less the cost than all these leading competitors, especially like click funnels. Um, if I was to say um, in comparison, which one um, the HBA funnel builder compares to most, it will be click funnels, all right? Because it does a lot of different things. So I'm gonna show you what it what it has here. And for twenty five dollars a month for your business, you can create capture pages, which is a landing page where they input their in, uh, email and email information and everything. You get to build out different pages. You have a membership site builder. You have a checkout order builder. Um, they have has super responsive pages, uh, have a video training to walk you through the steps on how to do everything. Uh, I mean, this is phenomenal. I mean, this does just about everything as all the other uh, page builder does and more. This is the one I use. Okay, so I would recommend, and this is, and. I, I gave you different options, but the training, when I get ready to start building out my business, I will be using the HBA Funnel Builder, okay? So if you want to uh, do walk along with me, um, that is cool, but I am using this. Uh, most of the, I, I can't tell you how all the other uh, pages work, how the other um how the other companies work with their pages, but I would assume it's pretty much the same. 
However, if you want to follow along step by step with me, then I would suggest that you get the funnel builder from the HBA Academy. All right. And I'll also have a link down below this video for that. All right. So this is what you're going to be. Let me see what I'm on. Okay. This is the funnel builder that I will be using to build out the pages, build out the page when I create my funnel. All right. In the next, in the coming up videos. All right, the last thing that you're going to need, and I'm going to show you how all of this stuff connects together. All right, <clears throat> the last thing that you're going to need is, is an autoresponder. Let me stop sharing my screen for a moment. But the last thing that you're going to need for your business is an email autoresponder. And what I have done with my business is basically I have uh, traffic coming into my landing page okay i'm offering people something that they want they input their email and their name into a short form and then it gets sent to my email responder okay so that's how this is connecting together now once they are in my email autoresponder now i can set up emails to automatically go out so I can schedule them to automatically go out to market product services, different trainings, and just provide as much value to um, potential customers as possible. So we're going to go over some email autoresponders. I haven't found any free, um, I don't think, but I'm going to share my screen and I'm going to show you the ones that I found and I'll also show you the ones that I recommend. All right, here we go. Oops. Wrong one. All right, we're going to share my screen again. All right, now I am going to close out some of these tabs here. All right. Uh, now, here are some options for you. Okay, now there are some free versions, so I will back that up a little bit. So there are some free versions. If you are on a budget, here's a free version for you, um, which is MailChimp. Um, I don't use MailChimp. However, um, there are a free version here where you can get started for free. Okay, now there are some restrictions on a lot of the free versions. Like um, when, when, you, when an email goes out, they'll have their their logo in your email. Me, I don't particularly enjoy having someone else's logo on my stuff. I prefer to have my own logo. So this is up to you as an option for you. So you can start this for free, all right? The next one is Send In Blue. Okay, you can also start this up, this for free. And you can send up to 300 emails per day. So this is also a free option for you, okay? Then we have active campaign, okay? Now we get into the, some of the pay versions, okay? Active campaign, the cheapest version is $15 a month, okay? And again, you get all of these different uh, benefits from it. However, like I said, this is these are ones that I use. I wanted to show you um, some of the, the one that I personally use and the one that I will be using when we go through this training. Um, I personally use Get Response, uh, and what I have is just the the cheapest version is the fifteen dollars a month. Okay, and you get all of this stuff: email marketing, autoresponders. You can create landing pages on here. I don't normally create landing pages on here. Um, and you can create all of these things. You have all of these benefits in here. Um, I usually use something else for that, but you can do it. Um, it's totally up to you. And you can have up to a thousand subscribers on this plan. Now, it may take you a moment to get to a thousand subscribers and that's okay. And if that's the case, then this plan is perfect for you. All right. so. I personally use get response. So I'm gonna stop sharing my screen real quick. All right, so 
um, all the tools that I personally use, there'll be a link down in the description below this video. Now, you know, here's the thing. A lot of people, the reason why I went with this business model is because a lot of people are afraid and they feel like they're not, they don't know how to sell or they don't know how to, you know, uh, they're afraid of approaching people about their business. You know, it's the fear of rejection. Now I had that fear of rejection and, you know, because people would reject me when I try to, when I tried to share with them an opportunity, you know, something that would help them, but then I'd get shut down and rejected. So I wanted to go into a different business model to where, I could deal with zero rejection and still make sales, all right? And if you don't like, I'm not gonna say if you don't like people, but if you don't enjoy, you know, having a conversation with someone or if you think that you can't do this, you, you can't sell this because nobody will buy, you know, most of this is mindset anyway. But if, you, if you're struggling with it, you know, then I will suggest that you choose a business model that fits you. Now, email marketing, this business, this um, business model fits me. All right. So and I want to show you exactly what I'm doing to make uh, sales using this strategy. OK, so, you know, basically, I know this bit training video was a bit long and I tried to, you know, keep it as short as possible, but I always try to over deliver and give you all the information that you need. So, you know, I've given you free options, you know, to start your business. You know, some things you just can't get around, you know, not being free. You know, there are some things that's going to cost you. However, this is for your business. This is how um, you set up a profitable business. Now I'm going to just recap. The first thing that you're going to need is a domain name. Okay. A domain name that is relevant for you and your business. The second thing that you're going to need is some kind of page builder so that when people, when you're sending people information or people coming to you for information, they can input, you know, their information and you can give them what they, what they're requesting. All right. And then the last thing that you're going to need is an auto a email autoresponder. All right. And that are those are the three simple tools that you need to build your business. For me, I spend about forty dollars a month. Building my business. <laughs> so, you know, that is that's a dinner for me. So a dinner a month for me. So I can take $40 and, and then reinvest it into my business because I am looking at the bigger picture because I want to, I don't want to be in the same place that I am today. I'm looking to build my business up and scale it. And I'm also looking to help you do the same. All right. So that does it for this training video. I appreciate you watching and I will see you in the next video. And we're going to be starting to, you know, build out our business. Let's get it. It's our time to be free.